as the world marks the International Day Against Drug Trafficking and Illicit Trafficking, countries have been advised to discourage legalizing the use of addictive substances such as cannabis and marijuana. The theme for this year is Share Fact on Drugs, Save Lives. Our correspondent Adeban Kyodoni has more on this. Opium, cocaine, ecstasy, these are a few of the names that come to mind when drug abuse is mentioned. Drug abuse and trafficking is a war that has been fought by the world for hundreds of years. And in order to express its determination to strengthen action and cooperation, the United Nations decided to observe 26th of June as the International Day Against Drug Abuse and Illicit Trafficking on 7th December 1987. This year's theme is Share Facts on Drugs, Save Lives. Speaking on strategies to ending this menace, a former drug user and founder of Global Center for Drug Eradication, KG Hamilton, said children should be taught about drugs and their effects, while parents must be educated on drugs as well. So I think what we need to start to do differently is to try to develop skills among young people so that they stop going to drugs. Because another thing we start to have to do differently is uh, we should try and stop stigmatizing those who use drugs as if they are weak people or they are not serious about life because going into drugs is not is not is the final stage of a lot of things that have been piling up in the emotional tank of every human being that going into drugs. On the issue of illicit trafficking, he said some highly placed people caused the high influx of drugs. We really need to fight the drug market itself, which is something I think is quite impossible. Why? There are nations who drugs trafficking makes for their GDP. I'm not going to mention names, you understand. One, number two, there are people that are high up there, the caliber of seat of power, that are actually sponsoring drug markets. Countries such as Canada, Georgia, South Africa and Uruguay have legalized cannabis and Nigerian lawmakers have a bill considering the legalization of marijuana. This was described as a bad idea. But if you ask me, from from that personally, that okay, do you think that cannabis should be legalized? I would say no, it shouldn't be legalized. Why? Because I know the effect of cannabis on the brain of anybody that uses cannabis. A report done by the UNODC said that non-medical use of cannabis and sedatives increased globally during the pandemic. Reporting for Plus TV Africa, Adebanke Odunui. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.